does, and is always willing to participate in any activity that shows school spirit. This is a student who is not shy and is able to encourage others to be enthusiastic. This is also a student who is always proud of St. Carol. Our recipient today has a smile that brightens up the room. Her laugh is contagious. She is someone you want by your side because she always cheers you on and gets everyone involved. She knows how to have fun in any school activity while still being responsible and always appropriate. Please join me in congratulating Ariana Kavala.
The first goes to an extraordinary grading boy who has not only exhibited exemplary leadership skills in sports as he pushed the intermediate boys basketball team to great heights, but also displayed immense dedication and skill as a standard player on his club basketball team. Furthermore, his contributions on the volleyball court, his swift strides on the track, competing in the 100 meter, and on the track for cross country, have been nothing short of remarkable. The second award goes to a girl who embodies the true spirit of athleticism and faith. She not only led her intermediate girls basketball team with grace and determination, but was also a key member of the volleyball team, a sprinter on the track, and a true driving force behind the girls soccer team divisional championship victory. She never lost focus of her upbeat and positive attitude, even in close matches or in times of adversity. I should have taken that, taken that out before heavy, heavy, heavy rain. Uh, really bad enough for you. Elbows to the gut and probably kicks to the shit, right? These grade eight girls, un these grade eight students, unwavering displays of Christian qualities in all aspects of their lives, stand them apart as role models, exemplifying humility, compassion, and integrity. It is an absolute pleasure to recognize and celebrate the remarkable achievements of these two exceptional athletes. Congratulations, DJ and Jessica. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It is my honor to present the Citizenship Award this evening. The definition of citizenship is the following. The state of being vested with the rights, privileges, and duties of a citizen. And this individual is viewed as a member of society with duties, obligations, and functions of a citizen. We have a recipient this evening who is extremely deserving of this recognition. The student is a true citizen of our St. Gerald community, as he fulfilled his duties as a responsible leader and role model and as a member of this society. He has been called upon to complete various duties like assisting staff and his peers with a variety of activities, creating slideshows, song playlists, leading our tech team, and sound crew. He was always ready and willing to give up his time. We would like to thank him for his continuous help and know that he will become a welcome and involved member of his new role in high school. This year's recipient of the Citizenship Award is Gabor Mazursky.
Ms. Fernandez will present the music award. The teacher's award is given to a student who goes above and beyond to assist with anything needed in the classroom and school while ensuring all of their academic responsibilities. Our recipient this evening particip participated in the many different activities offered in our school and class. She dedicated time to rehearse for her lead performance in The Sound of Music, spent countless hours creating slideshows throughout the year and creating the Grade 8 yearbook while balancing her busy extracurricular activities and played a key role in the many class and school initiatives. We will miss the students' eagerness to help and learn incredible work ethic her drive. Every day, this student says goodbye with a thank you. Thank you, Jabi Krishishina, for having me. Good evening, everyone. Uh, I was very proud and excited when I was asked to be the one to give the Academic Excellence Award. Normally, we first look at the marks, top marks, working for these marks across the curriculum. But we tend to forget the level of self-motivation that's needed, the curiosity, the desire to learn, always wanting to go to the next step and see how they can get there. But today we have another layer on top of that, and that is having come midway through elementary school without a word of English and motivating themselves to do this. We have two uh, recipients this evening, and these recipients push and pull each other to the next step. And tonight, I am so happy to give the award to Isabella Diaz. Salamanca and Valeria Diaz Salamanca.